What's up guys, Origin here, and I'm going to show you how to get onto the Rust experimental server. Basically Rust 2.0, you guys asked for it on my last video, so I figured I'd go ahead and show you. So basically you just go to your list of games, find Rust in your list, right click, go to properties, and go over to this tab here where it says betas on the top right. Click this, make sure it says experimental, and then once you click that it'll start updating, and you'll see over here on the bottom left where it says Rust, it'll say updating next to that and you'll see it says experimental next to it. That's how you know you did it right. So once that's done updating, you just click play, wait for it to pop up, choose your graphics settings and all that. And a lot of times it does this, it comes up half to the side in a window direction, so you gotta maximize that. And click play game, go to the server list. This one says my Rust server, but usually it'll say face punch dev server, something along those lines, but you should only have one or two show up, so just Double click on the server, you'll start loading the game. You'll notice the load screen is a little different, that's how you know you're in the right area. And then you just wait for it to pop up. And Usually when you first get into the game, your guy will just be laying on the ground sleeping. So then you just left click, wait a few seconds, and he'll jump up and it'll pop in first person view and you can start walking around. And a couple different uh, new things in the dev server is if you press F3, it goes third person mode. So you can see your guy's nice, beautiful, naked butt. I've pixelated it, so I don't have to worry about anybody complaining on YouTube. Uh, another thing you can do is press F2, and it'll bring up all your graphic options here that you can play with, like you see the sun rays and different things like that, and all those different options. So you can play around with those. It makes it run a little better for you if you have a lower-end computer. And uh, you also, you start out with a few things in your inventory. So you see you got these two hatchets. One of these hatchets is a stone. One of them is an actual uh, hatchet. And you drag your sweatshirt over there, you can put it on. There's different things you can craft right now. It's not a whole lot. It's still, uh, They still have a lot of work to do, but you can see where they're going with things. You got the little storage box, a couple campfires, and just basic crap. The pistol you can't do anything with yet. It doesn't actually equip. But uh, you can see when you place something down, it, it'll place another one on top of it. It's another bug they have going on right now. But it, it, So it places two, but one of them actually isn't there. Until you place something else, it goes away. But you can swing your rocks and your hatches, and you can gather and stuff like that. Not a whole lot to do, but shows you what they've been working on. So uh, let me know what you guys think with the comment below. And please share the video if you enjoyed it. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Hey, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. If you did, check out one of these other videos. Like and share, and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.